So what's your name? Steve. Steve, what's your last name? Jacob Bucci. All right, tell me about this Ford you got, this cab over. Oh, I bought it about 20 years ago and put it in the garage and uh, was trying to fix it up, but the motor was shot. I found this Winnebago motor and put it in here and got it running. So what year is it? 71. 71. C600. And do you know what it was used for? What kind the of life guy, it had? The guy I bought from used it to pull a race car. Okay. And that's all I know. And, uh, you know, I love the style of these things. Is that what drew you to? Uh, yeah, this? and I farm and I yeah. drive trucks, so this kind of fit in there, and I use it to pull a hay wagon and stuff like that. So it's a, it's a fun project. And so tell me about the engine. What's under the hood? It's well, four, under the cab. 454 with a turbo 400. So how much, how much horsepower? I don't know. It's just the standard 454 Four. for a Winnebago. Yeah. yeah. That's what it came out of. Oh, it sounds wicked. Yeah, can you, we, can you start up for us at some point? Do you What's mind? It? You start it up? I'd love to hear it. Sure. Yeah, yeah. I mean, Sounds really good. It sounds really good. So, does this truck do work, or is it just for fun? Yeah, I now? use it. Uh, I farm, so I use it to pull hay wagons and stuff. But it's mostly in the garage and used for car shows. Yeah, but yeah. I do use it. What do you think it was used for originally? I don't know. Yeah, I couldn't tell you. And how rusted was it when you got it? <laughs> it was in the shape it's in now. It was in really good shape. The only thing that was wrong was the motor and transmission. And what does it drive like? Tell me what it's like going down the road in this bad it's boy. It's pretty rough. Yeah. Uh, 45, 50 miles an hour is about top speed okay. with this gear ratio setup. Okay. Uh, I can get 55 out of it pretty easy, but then I'm turning about 2,600 RPMs. But you're already sitting way high, so you're yeah. kind of looking down on the rest of the world. Right. Um, do you have any other creature comforts that you've installed? Nope, not yeah. too much. Just yeah. roll the windows down and go. <laughs> and is this a truck you can actually take like on a cruise night or is it too big? I have. It just uh, don't go too far from home. I'd like to run it up to Golden for cruise night. But yeah. I haven't done it yet. But I go to Sonics and I go to small car shows and stuff like that around here. And how much money and time have you, you think you put into it? Oh, money-wise, I'm actually pretty cheap. I think I got about 6000 in it. Yeah. And labor, you don't figure labor. Yeah. It just countless hours. Yeah, huh? you just go with the flow. It's a love of rebuilding and working on these things. And um, is this a truck you're gonna keep, or is, are you yeah. one of those guys who kind of works on it? No, then, this uh, one I'll keep. I've yeah. had it 20 years, so I'll keep it. And do you have somebody to pass it down to eventually? Yeah, I got some grandkids uh, okay, fighting nice. over. <laughs> That's good. Well, so, thank you very much. You bet. Thanks I appreciate for it. Yeah, thanks.